Hey guys, Adam here. Today I have my jailbreak tutorial for the A5 devices. So the jailbreak is finally here. It's called Absinthe and it's going to work on both the iPhone 4S and the iPad 2. Now for the iPhone 4S, this jailbreak is going to be jailbreaking the iPhone 4S if it's on firmware 5.0 or 5.0.1. And for the iPad 2, this is only going to be jailbreaking it if it's on 5.0.1. So if you have an iPad 2, go ahead and update all the way to 5.0.1. And if you're on an iPhone 4 and you want an unlock, stay at 5.0 because there's a better chance that there's going to be an unlock release for 5.0 than for 5.0.1. However, the 4S jailbreak will work on both firmwares 5.0 and 5.0.1. Now, Absinthe was only released for Mac so far, so in this video, I'm going to be giving you guys a tutorial on Mac. The jailbreak process is really simple. Pretty much just download the software, which you can download at greenpoison.com. I'll put some mirror links as well in the description in case Green Poison is down. So basically, go ahead and click that link in the description, open up the program, and follow along with me. And as you guys can see here, my device is plugged into the computer. So there's a cable, and then it says iPhone 4S with iOS 5.0.1 detected. And keep in mind, you may see a restore icon on your phone. Don't worry about that. That is part of the jailbreak. So I'm going to click jailbreak, and I'm going to probably cut forward to when it's over. All right, so beginning jailbreak. This may take a while. Now you guys can see the restore in progress. Do not worry about this screen at all. This is completely normal. So as you guys can see there, waiting for reboot. Not done yet. Don't unplug your device. So it looks like the jailbreak is almost done. For some reason, the first time I attempted this jailbreak, I literally sat here for like 10 minutes and nothing was happening. But it looks like it is working this time. And it's just waiting for the reboot. So don't unplug your device, of course. And my device is now booting back up, which is good. Alright, and the program now says waiting for device to finish booting. There was another screen there. I think it said connecting the device. And it looks like my device is now back on. So uh, saving payload data. This may take a while. Do not touch your device yet. So do not touch that program yet. Alright, now it says almost done. Just unlock the screen if necessary. Then tap the jailbreak icon to finish. And maybe on a different home screen, so don't give up looking. And I have Absinthe on my second page right here. It's most likely going to be not on your first page. And it uh, looks like the device is almost done being jailbroken. I'm going to click this little logo here for Absinthe. And it looks like it's just a white screen, so let's wait for this to load. We do have the little uh, loading icon right there. And it says, error establishing a database connection. So it looks like it's a little bit down right here. I'm going to try this one more time. I'm going to end the program in multitasking. And if you get that same error, do the same and click it again. And I'm going to keep trying this until it works, so I may cut out a little bit of this video because it looks like the jailbreak is getting hammered right now. Alright, and after the Absinthe logo works and all, your device will now have Cydia on it. So click into Cydia, and now it says preparing file system, so Cydia will exit when complete. And then you're going to be able to choose if you want user, hacker, or developer. And anyways guys, that's pretty much how to jailbreak your iPhone 4S or iPad 2 on 5.0.1. If you guys enjoyed this tutorial, be sure to leave a like rating down below. Also, be sure to hit that favorite button down below. It really helps me out. And click that subscribe button above if you're not already. I post all my daily tweak and theme reviews on this channel. So if you guys want to be informed with all the latest things in Cydia, then make sure to subscribe. I'm just going to choose developer here, and you guys can click done. And now your iPhone 4S and iPad 2 is just broken on 5.0.1 so anyways guys hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial like i said leave a like rating down below favorite the video and subscribe thanks all for watching